somebody's in love with you mutable signs let's go ahead and take a look at the overall energy especially since we're leading up to the taurus new moon this is a huge manifestation make sure that you're on my schedule if you want to go ahead and get a ritual candle with me or maybe you're wanting to burn your own candles at home i got you covered make sure you take a look at the links at the down bar below okay let's start with the first mutable sign gemini sun moon and rising let's go take a look and see the energy that you need to know upcoming for this taurus new moon okay so we have the chariot card up right and this is heavily impacting your family life i see that there's some things going on here you're being pulled in different directions here gemini and emotionally speaking you do want to keep the peace but that peace is tearing you apart so this taurus new moon definitely focus on what you want to see moving here forward okay sagittarius sagittarius sun sagittarius moon and sagittarius rising let's take a look at your overall energy upcoming for this taurus new moon and it looks like it is manifestation it is love and it's also still dealing with a third party situation but this time the third party situation and is outside there's somebody else calling out here for you. So it's kind of like a third party situation outside of the situation, if that makes sense. Uh, but Sagittarius, you do have people that are interested in you and you have lost interest in that person, but somebody else has kind of circled back around. Let me know as it goes and definitely work with me because it seems like a sticky situation. Okay, Pisces, Pisces sun, Pisces moon, and Pisces rising, let's take a look at your overall energy that you got upcoming for this Taurus new moon. Now, this is a huge benefit, Pisces. It looks like financially speaking, things are getting a lot better here for you. You might even thinking about moving, promotions, and accepting. So maybe that you started at the bottom, now you're already at the middle and the top, Pisces. I see career-wise, everything's going very well. However, partnership, there is a new partnership here of Bruin, and we'll see as those things develop a little bit further okay let's go for the last mutable sign virgo virgo sun virgo moon and virgo rising let's take a look at your overall messages upcoming right before this taurus new moon okay seven of swords reverse you're having some second chances some second guesses at the same time the universe is showing you karmic cycles what are you gonna do with it this looks like the same thing before and now with the taurus new moon you have the ability to manifest a new future not relive the same thing so you let me know what you want to do upcoming this time all right let's go ahead and cover one last thing thank you bonus round let's take a look at the spiritual messages and who this is to because i really feel like this is calling to one of these signs out right here and absolutely so it's virgo Virgo sun, Virgo moon, Virgo rising. You're absolutely right. I can't leave you hanging on this. Things are going to get better. It looks like there's no wrong choices here. Even though you are presented with the karmic cycle, you are aware of it. You're making fine little minute changes and those changes are leading off to bigger payoffs. It looks like you're returning. You're coming back. Financial things are coming back to you. You're going to be seeing a lot of spiritual numbers, 555, five, five, indicating that you're entering a new spiritual realm as well as a financial spiritual changes. As with they say, great changes comes with great responsibility. And I know, Virgo, you're going to be able to handle it. Let's see who else we got for somebody else. And it is, again, Virgo. I'm going to go ahead and leave you go. You know what you got to do. Thank you so